All right, so the other day, the Bears played the um, Gorillas, but um, the camera was dead, so, but they had to play the game. Um, in, their, in the first inning, Xander actually had a person playing with him other than Brady or somebody. He had Hudson um, just helping him out for that day. Um, uh, so in the first inning, the Bears had a six-run mercy cap. Xander had a home run with, I think, three more RBIs, and Hudson had some, two RBIs in that inning with um, two hits and a walk, I think. So, and then in the bottom of the first, Logan had, Lo Logan also had the six-run mercy cap, but then in the top of the um, second, um, the Bears got the mercy cap, and then Logan did not score. So going into the top of the third, it was 12 to six, and um, the Bears scored two, making it 14. Or no, they scored one. It was 12 it, to seven. I got one run. Okay, he got one run, 12 to seven, and then the Bears got two runs, I believe, which made it 14 to seven, putting them down by seven. But there's no mercy in the third inning. So going into the bottom, I think Hudson started off the inning kind of rough, loading the, walking the bases loaded, which meant um, I think one run scored, and then I believe they got an, no no out at first, but Logan got a double, which um, scored two runs, but they already had he already had um, one run scored, so at that point it was 14 to 10. So then there was guys on second and third, and um, he hit a three-run home run, which would be, what is it, 14, thir yeah, 14, 13. And then um, there was a single, or a triple, a single and a walk, which had the bases loaded. And the gorilla, Logan came through clutch with a walk-off grand slam. So, yeah. What that means for the playoffs, well, first of all, we'll just talk about the playoffs in general. So, or the standings. So the Panthers are in first place currently right now at 5-0. and If they win um, their next two games, or at least just, or if they win one more game, they'll for sure be at least a tie for first place. So, but if they win two games of their last three, they will be alone in first place. So the Nightmares, who are in second place, if the Panthers lose two of their last three games and only get one win, and the Nightmares win the rest of their games, which I think is two more, if they go 2-0 and in their last two games, they will get a share of first place, and that will force a playoff against the Panthers for first place, for, or for the one seed in the playoffs okay and for the gorillas so the gorillas are already out of first place they can't get in first place and i do not think they can get in second place so that means they're just trying to stay in third place and get that three seed but if the bears win they're let's see what are they what are they guys six and oh they're oh and six the bears are oh and six if they win their next two games their last two games, they have to win them. And the Gorillas lose their last game. That will mean the Gorillas will end up in last place. If the Panthers win one of their two games and the Gorillas do not get a win in their last game against the Nightmares, that will force a playoff for them to see who gets to be the three seed. So, yeah, this um, last game for the Gorillas is going to be crucial for them. And the Bears, it would be really nice to go 2-0. And um, if they go 2-0 and, and the Gorillas win their next game, that will mean um, that will mean uh, that will be autom an automatic playoff if the Gorillas win their next game and the Bears win two games. That'll be an automatic playoff to see who gets the three suit. So yeah, that's how the playoffs going to look. This looks this is the bracket right here. So uh, hope you enjoy the playoffs coming up.